this video tutorial i will explain how to download and install mongodb 8 on windows 11 operating system step 1 is download mongodb 8 for that go to mongodb website using this link then uh, from the drop down menu choose uh, mongodb 8 stable version then uh, make sure you select uh, windows as operating system then uh, download the msi package you can see the MSI package under package option. Here you can select uh, MongoDB version, which you want to download. And uh, platform is uh, Windows operating system and uh, package uh, is uh, MSI package. Click on download. It is uh, downloading. And uh, here you can see the MongoDB installer MSI package is downloaded. Step 2 is install MongoDB 8. For that, you have to run the installer. Locate the downloaded MSI installer file and uh, double click to run it. Then accept the license agreement. Click on next. Then uh, choose the installation type. There will be two options provided complete or custom. And uh, it is recommended to choose complete unless you want to customize the installation location or components. Then uh, install MongoDB as service. In the service configuration screen, choose to install MongoDB as a Windows service. This will ensure MongoDB starts automatically when your computer boots up. You can either leave the default service name or if you want to change the service name, you can change it. For run services network service user, you can leave the default option checked. Next, choose the data and log file paths. By default, MongoDB will set the data directory and log directory. You can either accept this or if you want to change the path, you can change it. Next, it will show MongoDB Compass installation, which is optional. MongoDB Compass is a GA tool for interacting with uh, Mongo database. You can choose to install it by keeping the checkbox checked. And uh, if you don't need a GUI, you can uncheck the option. Then uh, click on install. The MongoDB 8 installation will begin. You have to wait until the process is complete. Here you can see the installer file. Double click to run it. Choose the setup type. I am selecting complete. Here you can see service configuration screen. And I am going to install MongoDSA service. And this also selected. Run services network service user. Service name is MongoDB. If you want to change, you can change it. This is the data directory path. This is the log directory path. If you want to change it, you can change it. I'm going to keep the default one. Install MongoDB Compass. I'm going to install MongoDB Compass. So this is checked. Click on finish. Installation is completed. Step 3 is set up MongoDB on Windows 11 operating system. For that, first verify MongoDB installation. Once installation is complete, open the command prompt or PowerShell, then type the command mongod version. You will see the version of MongoDB 8 which was installed. Run this command and uh, it is saying MongoD is uh, not recognized as an internal or external command. To make it work, we have to set the environment variable path till the bin folder of uh, MongoDB. We will see how to do that. Right click, click on system, click on advanced system settings, 
click on environment variables under system variables select path click on edit click new till win folder copy the path Close this uh, command prompt. Open the command prompt again. Now run the same command mongod hyphen hyphen version. And uh, here you can see DB version is uh, 8.0.1. And uh, here you can see the build info. From this, we can confirm MongoDB 8 is uh, successfully installed in the Windows 11 operating system. Next one is run MongoDB. MongoDB should already be running as a Windows service if you install it as a service. You can check the status by typing services.msc. Then you can see the screen in that you can find MongoDB in the services list and make sure it is running. Run this command. And here you can see the services list. Search for MongoDB. And here you can see MongoDB server. And it is running successfully. Next one is start MongoDB manually. If you did not install MongoDB as a service or you need to start it manually, then open the command prompt. Then go to the bin folder of MongoDB installation. Then start MongoDB using the command mongod. Step 4 is connect to Mongo database. The first way is connect via MongoDB shell. Open the command prompt or PowerShell and type the command mongo. This will start MongoDB shell. Using that, you can connect to your MongoDB instance. Run this command. Looks like uh, Mongo shell is not installed. We will see how to install and uh, use it. Search for uh, MongoDB shell. Open this link. Here you can see the version 2.3.2 MongoDB shell we can download. Operating system is uh, Windows. Package we will choose uh, MSI. Click on download. It is uh, downloading. The installer is downloaded. Double click. It is uh, going to install this location. I am going to change the path. Here you can see it is installed successfully. Copy this path. Right click system. Advanced system settings. Environment variables. Click on path. Edit. Add new. And paste the path. Open command prompt. Type uh, mongo sh. And uh, here you can see it is uh, successfully connected to MongoDB 8 instance using uh, mongo shell. And uh, it is showing the databases which is there in the MongoDB 8 instance. Admin, config, local. Use local database, show collections. 
there is one collection is there it is showing that the second way to connect to mongo database is using mongodb combus it will allow you to connect to your mongodb instance using graphical interface you have to enter this default connection string to connect locally we will see how to do that open mongodb compass click on add new connection and this is the default connection string click on save and connect and it is successfully connected to mongodb instance and it has three databases Step 5 is create a database and collection. Once connected to Mongo database, you can create your first database and collection. In the MongoDB shell, run this command. Use the database name. Then to create a collection, you have to use the command db.createCollection, then the collection name. Use my database to create the database. To create the collection, use db.createCollection, then the collection name. It is successfully created. Show collections. And here you can see the collection, my collection is created. So the conclusion is you have now successfully installed and set up MongoDB 8 on Windows 11 operating system. You can now start developing or managing your databases locally. Thanks for watching. If you like this video, please click on like button and please subscribe to my channel. You can get Java source code and PowerPoint presentation for each and every video. That you can see it in the description section of the video. Click on show more and here you can see the description and here you can see the links to download source code and powerpoint presentation